Hello everybody, before we start the video, I just want to give a quick thanks to my gracious and generous supporters over on Patreon, to AnimeGuy01, Bookworm, Danish Fay, and Tommy Koistinen. Thank you for so much for your continued support, and if any of you want to support me as well on my Patreon account, there's a link to it in the description below. Now, enjoy the video! It's Jamie Fire Flame talking and welcome back to the next My Little Pony Friendship is Magic reaction. This time around, we're going to watch My Little Pony Friendship is Magic uh, Season 8, Episode 14 A Matter of Principles. Um, I'm not completely 100% on what the, the Matter of Principles like. I know it's a, a, like, a term for something, I can't remember what it is. But Matter of Principles, are we back to the school again? Not a kind of school episode, but this time about principles and stuff? The, the My Little Pony team likes to make puns about the names like that in about the episode. So, I can only expect this in another school episode, so no more dilly-dallying because I want to get through this as fast as you want me to. So, let's go. In 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, Spike with Wings is so awesome. Who can tell me what these are? Whoa. You are treasure? Nope! They're all legendary magical artifacts! Oh! <laughs> I've read ahead in Equestrian Cultures and Camaraderie, Volume 7. <laughs> You're right, Acela. Nice. This is the Amulet of Aurora, the Talisman of Mirage, the Helm of Yixler, the Crown of Grover, Knuckerbocker's Shell, and Clover the Clever's Cloak. Clover! Yeah, the gems are real! Uh, not that I tasted them. Ah. Princess Celestia gifted these to our school, since they each represent one of the cultures our students come from. Hey! And we'll learn all about them with a spell render hunt. Spell render hunt? Is that a pony thing? Uh, it's a magical scavenger hunt. Each of you will work in pairs to try to find where in the school these artifacts are hidden. The team that finds most wins a private tour of the Canterlot archives with Princess Celestia. <laughs> the Canterlot archives, huh? Does it get any better than that? You've been underwater a long time, yeah. haven't you? Gallus and Silverstream, sounds like you're our first pair. Hey! <gasps> what? They'll make a great team. Um, why pony glowing? Oh, shoot, the map! Luckily, the, lucky that the school is so close. Wait, you all work Wait, on we're all... friendship quest too? Is that a season... It's not the season finale yet. I'm terribly far away. What the heck? Just getting there will take days. Do y'all know what this means? There won't be any teachers left to run the school. <gasps> oh, we're going to have we're going to have some new principals for the school while they're gone. Oh my. Well, I guess the first like I would I didn't think Starlight first. Little pony, until you all share its magic with me. Big adventure, tons of fun. A beautiful heart, faithful and strong. Sharing kindness is an easy feat, and magic makes it all complete. So a matter of principles. I I think again that like someone is okay. So someone is going to take over while they're gone. Startup would be my first thought. Maybe they're going to bring in Shira Lee. Should we send our students home? I say we take. Ah! In the middle of my friendship quilting class. I think not. All of those unfinished seams. <laughs> <laughs> Problem is, we don't even know how long we'll be gone. Yeah. Don't worry, every pony. It's a big I one. I have a 70 point plan in place for this very situation. Wait, what? How? You oh. want me to be happy? Hey, it's what I said! You're the perfect choice. You're a good leader and an expert in friendship. A good leader. I trust you to run this school exactly as I would. Um, oh no, don't say that. Responsibility, Twilight. Which is why I've prepared everything you need. Oh, cry. The curriculum, rules for the Spellvenger hunt, dining hall menus for the next six months. How, um... Six months? Yikes. You're not really going to be gone that long, are you? And Spike. Anything that isn't covered in my files, he'll be able to help you with. And why not put him in charge? No, thanks. Uh, 
being a princess for Twilight was hard enough. Oh, I'm gonna pretend good I'm call, princess. Spike. Good call. But if you're sure it's what you really want, I promise I won't let you down. I knew I could count on you. Oh, dear. Great. What could possibly go wrong? Well, Starlight, you are left to supervise an entire school alone with a bunch of directions and Goodbye, not really a sense of how to run a school properly without cool. turning it into a I'm cult, so I can say that everything can go wrong. Oh, Discord, hi. Huh? I hate goodbyes, don't you? I just go to pieces. <laughs> Discord. God damn it, Discord. What, uh, nice surprise. But is he going to help? This is your first time at our new school, isn't it? Oh, was I not invited to the grand opening? Friends and family day, baccalaureate? I had no notice. notice. <laughs> well, at least you're here now. Um, why are you here now? To fill in for Twilight, of course, as head draconicless. Uh, I seem to recall a whole song about how this school is where you make your own rules. Now, who better at that than me? Uh, Starlight has already been given that position, Starlight dude. Starlight is in charge now. Really? I thought there must be some mistake. Nope. Twilight picked me for the job, and she left pretty detailed instructions for me to follow. Well, I'm sure that she wouldn't mind if I made a few tiny suggestions. Tiny. <laughs> Item one. Gravity is optional. Oh, dear. Oh, God. Uh, uh, uh. Uh. Item two. The school's new mascot is an ambidextrous marmoset. Ah. Uh. Item three. It's not gonna happen. I promised Twilight I'd handle this her way. So thanks, but no thanks. Really? A matter of principles. Well, we'll see if you change your mind. Uh oh. When we play Ogres and Oubliettes, and he puts that many E's and really, the things don't usually end well. Oh dear. Worry, he's he's that kind of player, huh? I hope he doesn't grief. He'll be fine. <coughs> What's next on Twilight's list? I can already kind of predict. And it flies gracefully into the sunset. Get the artifacts for the Spellinger hunt and ordered school supplies for the week. All you have to worry about is teaching class. Ah, oh, thanks, Spike. Maybe we will get through this okay. Hey. No. Ah. I swear. Come in, come in. You'll let the Twitter mites out. Twitter mites? <laughs> okay, confirmation those things are real. No pony was at your desk. Imagine what Twilight would say. <laughs> oh, godness. Oh, how could you, Starlight? You've broken my trust and failed me completely. Oh, don't worry. I'll cover for you. By the way, I hope you like Limburger cheese. I got a month's supply for the teacher's lounge. Spike. Ah, Jesus! That was not a very good idea. Come here, Discord. Go relax. Have a cup of tea at home. Oh, some thanks for all my help. And what help? All those substitute teachers for you. Actually, that does sound kind of helpful, and it was next on our to-do list. Uh. Which teachers did you hire? Yeah, which ones? They call it making friends because you have to make creatures be your friends. Why? Show me what you why? Can. Why him? He's the worst. <clears throat> be my friend. If you're quiet, I don't buy it. Be my friend. I've heard pudding that's more convincing. Oh. My oh goodness me! Twilight teaches friendship. No, that's not how it goes. Cranky, really? Some field trip. Where's my iced tea? <sighs> this is too cold. <laughs> now it's too hot. Cranky is a douche. Now it's too tea flavored. You call yourselves friends. Wow. That is definitely not how Twilight teaches. No. Friendship. 
a tree. You hired a tree as a teacher? Its schedule was free. Uh, guys, that's not just any tree. Oh! Oh, it's that thing! It's a dragon sneeze tree. Oh, her fire is pretty beautiful. So beautiful and destructive at the same time. You're gonna love me! My, my, my. You do seem like you're in over your head. Uh, well, only because you are here. With how you're ruining, I mean, running her school. Discord, this is all because of you. None of this can be put on Starlight. That's all, this is all your fault, dude. Discord, this is all your fault. Exactly. Mine. I thought you were in charge here. But I'm happy to pitch in if you need me. What I need is for you to leave. Happy now? Oh, God damn it. Come on, Discord. You know that's not what she means. Fine. From now on, I won't try to help at all. I guess that also means he doesn't, he's not going to try and fix it. He stays gone. I wouldn't count on it. I think Discord's trying to test you. But why? I thought we were friends. You know, it's kind of what he does. Even to ponies or dragons he cares about. <laughs> oh, well, I'm ready Unless they're father shy. I told Twilight I'd run her school right, and I'm gonna keep that promise. No matter what. It... God damn it. Good morning. That, that freaking thing again! I I know there's been a little bit of adjustment since the professors left for their trip, but I've brought in new new teachers. New new teachers. Why Trixie? Well, everything should run smoothly. <laughs> now it's time for class, and don't forget. Spitfire, I can kind of get. Spellbinger hunt. Mod, I can kind of see it. Trixie. Yo. Oh. Fellow creatures. Hello, fellow kids. <laughs> You may call me the great and powerful Professor Trick. Oh, Shh. really? That's so inconsiderate. <laughs> God damn it, this court. Oh, I better take this. It's a banana phone. Hello. Ring, 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 ring. Banana oh, phone. He did not. And what did you say? <gasps> you did not. Discord. Why are you here? Why, I'm a student of friendship, of course. Unless you don't think you're good enough to teach me. Of course I am. No fruit calls in my class. What? Is the most <sighs> it's this court. Of friendship. That wasn't very. So today, that I, isn't very the appealing. And powerful Trixie, will put on a magic show. Why? Well, I guess I don't know. Therapy! Jesus Christ! Oh, I'm learning so much, aren't you? Discord! Ah, oh, Jesus. Hello? Um, what exactly is a long distance plan? I don't get it. Sorry, Take Adam. A lap, team. Uh, actually, we just finished Professor Spitfire's workout. Sounds like some pony needs a little motivation. <laughs> All of the freaking callbacks. Friendship is about honesty, so believe me when I say we're not stopping. <laughs> I believe Twan is going to have a word on twenty hundred with you Discord when they get back. Discord, that's enough. Endangering students crosses the line. 
I don't know why you're trying to ruin this school, but it stops now. I wouldn't be so sure. This is your last warning. Oh, Jesus. Hey, <laughs> take it easy, Starlight. This court's your friend, remember? Well, he's not acting like it. Exactly. She's right, Discord. What's your problem? My problem? Exactly. How is the fact that Twilight decided to put an incompetent, power-hungry unicorn in charge of her school my problem? <gasps> Jesus Christ! <laughs> Don't worry. I just banished him from school grounds forever. He's fine. That probably made things worse. That was a freaking trigger. Because he's right about one thing. I've been doing a terrible job as head mayor. Only no, because he's interfered. Discord is just being Discord. Maybe. But I wonder why me being in charge bothers him so much. We can figure that out after the Spellbinger hunt. Come on! I really hope that Discord has a good reason after all of this. For this afternoon's Spellbinger hunt. You'll need to use the artifact's history to find where they're hidden in the castle. When you spot one, touch it with a magic shield to keep track of your score. Twilight left a list of your hunt partners before she left. I'll pass out the shields. So how is this score going to ruin this one? Ready, set, Spellbinger hunt! <laughs> Come on, we can use Twilight's observatory to watch the teams. I hope you know where you're going. To the helm of Yixler! Eh, works for me. In our book, it says Yixler was an honorable Yak warrior. Any enemies that saw him put down their weapons in peace. Really? I think his artifact must be in one of these suits of armor. Ah, uh, I can see it. Right there. I'm guessing that one. Hey! Yes! One down, five to go. These two are adorable. Oh, Celis and Smolder found their first artifact. I can see why these two are shipped. I've seen kind of a couple of pictures on Twitter. What the heck? I don't think that's part of the salvager hunt. What the hell? Discord, what is your deal? Yeah, I doubt that. But at least I know where one of the artifacts is. Saw Spike hiding yesterday. The crown of Grover. Score! The King Grover. They say it's magic, and King Grover used it to become the first ruler of Griffinstone. I know. Pretty sweet, right? You paid attention in class! <laughs> what? And now those two are shipped. Ah. 3D. It's a concept in a quest, yeah. The hell? Ah, Discord. Yeah, that's definitely Discord. Freaking poltergeist. I thought you banished him from the school. Only his body. Apparently his ghost can come and go just fine. Let's go. We have to stop this. His ghost can... How? What? No, but I don't think magic is the answer against Discord. This time, I'm not using magic. Oh. It's hmm. a clever little what one. What you want to look for? The shell of Knuckerbocker. It's like a seashell, but if you blow into it, you call it dragon. There's a sweet poem in her book about it. Climb to the heights with dragon flight. <gasps> like flight of stairs. You wanna take pony word for it? <laughs> eh. Huh? Uh, what's happening? Uh, I'm I'm so happy that we're getting more focus on the students. Fucking <laughs> <Game> hell. <laughs> Uh, I can imagine this is like a a taste of what it was when Discord ruled. That it was very something like this.
A haunted house is fun. I can't uh, say anything against that. It's Discord. Said Mayor Starlight, look at me, look. I won the spell venture hunt. Well done, me. Now, what's my prize? Detention. Well, that's disappointing. Discord, you can't keep messing up the school. On the contrary, I think I rather can. Uh huh. Will. Then I have just one thing to say to you. Well, do go on. I'm sorry. What? I had to stop thinking like a head mayor and start thinking like a guidance counselor to finally understand. You felt left out. Uh, I, 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 oh. I, I don't know what you're getting at. Oh. No pony ever invited you to the school. And when you offered to help, I didn't listen. I was so worried about doing things Twilight's way, I didn't stop to think about being a good friend. I'd like to apologize for that. And offer you the job of Vice Head Mayor. Huh? Really? What? what? No! I'm totally confused. No, I was Sandbar. I accept. I mean, I, I suppose I can find some time in my busy schedule to help you out. Ah, uh, Discord. But I will need my own office, expense account, parking space. You're new to the world of education, aren't you? <laughs> Next time you want something, just ask for it, all right? Well, then we'd miss out on all those delightful misadventures. Hey! Watch the wings! Now, Vice Head Mayor Discord, if you'll help me get the Spellvenger hunt back in order. Everything is re-hidden. Ah! Oh, well, with a few surprises. Oh, God. This school is Discord. Whoa! I can't believe you tricked us into going on a friendship quest that what? wasn't real. Oh, back so soon. What? The glamours fell on our cutie marks. A fake summons from the map. Hey, at least we got to go spelunking in that really creepy cave with all those eyeless worm creatures chasing us. What? Oh, Jonah, so glad Pony's back. Uh, y'all get the feeling we missed something? You have Thanks no idea. The school starlight. It was a challenge. <laughs> but I think things turned out just the way you'd have handled them. Guess this means you're not vice head mayor anymore. Ah. Oh, poo. I just ordered business cards. <laughs> God damn it. Alrighty then. This is a weird one. This is definitely a fun but weird one. Like, I am always up for watching Discord doing shenanigans. Like, it's Discord. And it allows the animators to go completely wild and just do things. And all of the references. Freaking, hello, fellow kids. <laughs> uh. Discord is really, he is an interesting character. I really like, I really like him. He's one of my favorite non-pony characters. Um... He doesn't like he doesn't know how to properly express himself. So instead of just like, you know, talking out about it, because he does he is still not sure how to handle that, he just causes mishap. And are doing all of these things. And again, when when the school was all haunted and everything was running around chasing the students, I could only imagine that this was like a taste, like a, a taste of the appetizer of what it was like when Discord was in power of Equestria and just caused overall chaos. Like, I can imagine it was something like that, except like, 100,000 million times more. Uh, Starlight was wonderful as always, and like Discord, he didn't know, like, him and Starlight are a very interesting couple when it comes to like, character interactions, all this stuff, because both of them are not 100% on how to handle any, like, the given situations that they were in. Discord lashed out because that he, like, he was left out, and so he struck against the Starlight in an attempt to ruin it for her and get Twilight mad at her, but and then in return out on the, on the courtyard, or not courtyard, in the sports place, uh, Starlight 
was, I think she was probably triggered this time and just blasted him away. And <sighs> these two are among my, my favorite characters for many reasons. Uh, because they have these kind of interactions, these kind of reactions. So yeah. Many say that, I have heard many say over the years that it's wrong for the show to redeem villains. But if they didn't, we wouldn't have have these kind of episodes. That is what like, like they could have maybe introduced some other characters with the same kind of loss. But because we know their background, where they come from, it makes these actions and these episodes much more enjoyable. Like, making Starlight the head mayor and give her control. Like, she could handle a bunch of misfits in uh, in the season 6 uh, finale. But handle a school of students? Uh, I was kind of afraid that some of her old thoughts would begin to go back and she would like go back to her old bad habits or something like that. I was kind of afraid that, that would happen, but it didn't. And the only thing that went wrong was because of Discord. I believe, like, every every time she tried to do something else, it did kind of work. Like, so everything, the uh, Starlight's blaming herself and all that, no, that's not her fault. That was, it was all Discord's fault. But it makes sense why he does it. Like, it's just like, uh, like, he was made out to be a villain and all that. And, and I can imagine that some say that the excuse for why he did it will be kind of like half-assed. But I don't think so. I, I still think it makes sense. I still think it works. And it's one of those, I think this is one of those episodes that I can watch again later and find more enjoyable because of it. Uh, it's one of those episodes. Well, on the first viewing, viewing it may be... But as soon as you see it, but when you see it again, it may get better. Maybe I'm the only one who thinks that, I don't know. But, I enjoyed this episode, and I hope you did as well. So, thank you all so much for watching, my dear friends. Please tell me in the comments below what you thought about this episode and my reaction and my entire channel in general. Please tell me both positive and negative, so I can use it all to grow and evolve into a better entertainer for you guys. But as always, my dear friends, thank you all so very much for watching. My name is Johnny Fireflame, and I'll see you guys next time.